necessarily a clear formula. You just listen to a lot of music. I guess but we do try to make it make sense. You mimic, your, you mimic your favorite songs and your favorite bands and you just take bits and pieces of, of you know, elements of all the different kinds of music that you listen to and just sort of turn it into your own sort of twist on it. And uh, it just sort of comes out in, in, in one piece. Everyone's baking cakes and using different ingredients. And then what we realized when we started writing and like just like messing around, you're like, oh, I can use these ingredients too. Here the Performing is definitely a rush like no other. And uh, as long as they're into the music, it's just the greatest feeling of all. to be able to have, um, you know, a song of, of mine in the top ten or something like that and also have a song that I've produced or written for someone else on it. So that's like my, you know what I mean, if you want to picture the, the, the end goal, I guess, to that question. But um, that, would be, that, would be a good, that would be a good thing. Because it's really hard to just sort of write by yourself. Anybody who does that and can continue to do that and not hit walls, and by all means, it's just, that's, a, that's a talent in its own. But, um, I knew Harry from long ago, and you know, he was he was nearby, he was living nearby, and you know I called him up originally just to kind of you know get a beer and hang out and play some guitar. And, uh, this is a song about a trainer. I think we were two guys playing our own songs to get together before, and now we're actually kind of like playing our songs. You know, it's really cool. it's good. It's good the Vindicats. That's it guys, thank you, thank you guys for